In this last introductory video, we will explore a few more commonly used features of Elixir. The Clear Cache button will remove all the data that has been stored locally for the connection and this workbook. The next time we refresh our report, all new data will be retrieved. From time to time, we may wish to share our workbook with a non Velixo user. If we were to send them this file, for example, they would not be able to view any of the values from cells with Velixo functions, such as this one. We can use the Snapshot button on the Velixo ribbon. After we click that button, we will be prompted whether we want to create a snapshot of the entire workbook or just the current worksheet. And if just the worksheet, if we want the snapshot to be created in this workbook or in a new workbook. We can also choose whether we want to remove just the Velixo functions and formulas or remove all functions and formulas. Once we click Snapshot, our request will be completed. We can see that all the Excel functions and calculations are still in place, but the Velixo functions have been replaced with just the values they return. If we click on Options, we can see the Refresh Data When Opening File option that we reviewed in a previous video. We also have options for where we want to create our drill down sheets and whether or not to include blanks when we hide zero rows or columns. The Missing Identifier option allows us to choose whether we want to see an error message or have a Velixo function return a zero value when a specified account, subaccount, branch, project, or other identifier is not found. This option is useful when creating reports that consolidate data from multiple tenants with different configurations. Changing this option will cause our report to automatically refresh to reflect the change we have made. The Account Balance Sign option allows us to control the way the balances for both liability and income counts are represented in our workbook. When set to normal, which is the default value for Velixo, credit balances for liability and income accounts will be displayed as positive values, and the debit balances will be displayed as negative values. When set to reversed, those credit balances for liability and income accounts are displayed as negative values and the debit balances are displayed as positives. In this mode, the total balance for all accounts is equal to zero. This is another option that will trigger an automatic refresh after making a change. If you wish to learn more about Felixo, we recommend that you navigate to our online help center at help.felixo.com. If you are in Excel, you can easily get to the Help Center by clicking Support and Documentation here in the Velixo ribbon. Going into the Knowledge Base, you will see a variety of pages to choose from and a helpful search box that you can use to find specific topics. You may also want to take a look at the Templates section, where you will find a series of sample reports that are designed to illustrate basic usage. Simply find the sample that best meets your needs and download the file and any supporting files directly from the Help Center. This completes the Getting Started series. We hope you have found these videos helpful. Please reach out if you have an idea for future video topics. Thanks for watching.